now, your latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. I'm Cynthia Newsom. This is 41 Action News. Kansas City police are searching for the suspect in Kansas City's 97th homicide of this year. It happened just after 10 o'clock Thursday night near a gas station near 35th and Prospect. Right now, we don't know what led up to the shooting. Police say they found the victim in the parking lot of that gas station. He died at the scene. Police are still trying to find the shooter. They did arrest one person for trying to stab an officer and one person for trying to break into the crime scene. And Anyone with information about this is asked to call the TIPS hotline. TIPS leading to an arrest in homicides in Kansas City are worth up to $25,000 and you can remain anonymous. A woman is recovering after being shot this morning. This all happened just after 6 this morning. An off-duty Raytown police officer was driving on Raytown Road when he came across the woman running from the suspect's car. The officer was taking her to police headquarters when the suspect fired at the officer's car and then fled. When they got to police headquarters, officers realized the woman had been shot. She was taken to an area hospital. The officer was not hurt. The suspect is in police custody. All right, starting today, you will need to wear a mask across most of Kansas. Kansas Governor Laura Kelly's order applies to all public places where social distancing isn't possible. There are exemptions for children under the age of five and people with certain medical conditions. As for enforcement, that's up to local governments. Johnson County leaders got into a heated debate yesterday about it, but voted that it would enforce the mandate. Miami County unanimously voted no. Your forecast. I'm meteorologist Lindsay Anderson. Highs today approach 90 degrees. That goes for each day this holiday weekend. An isolated storm chance is possible. You can get the latest news and weather anytime at KSHB.com.